The Federal High Court sitting in Aduikiti has adjourned till April 14th. The civil suit brought before it by the Ikiti State Attorney General uh, Olawashile Olawa Faponda against the IG of Police Mohamed Adamu over the dismissal of a pregnant policewoman. Correspondent Olasukomi Ogumuko reports that Olajide Omolola, an unmarried female police corporal attached to Iyekiti uh, station, was sacked for getting pregnant. According to the police, the corporal, uh, corporal contravened Section 127 of the Force Act and regulations, which provides that an unmarried female police officer who became or becomes pregnant rather shall be dismissed from the force and shall not be re-enlisted except with the approval of the Inspector General of Police. Representing the state at the court, the Attorney General swung into action by praying that the court should determine, among others, whether the provision is not in violation of the combined provisions of Section 37 and 42 of the Constitution. Faponda also seeks an order of perpetual injunction restraining the IGP, the AKT Commissioner of Police and Police Service Commission, from implementing the regulation. Because of how uh, the perception of uh, the Anatolia over the years, it has always been that uh, the, the thought that all we do is to prosecute. Uh, that is not actually uh, correct. But having said that, it's all about the, you know, um, knowledge, uh, broadening our knowledge of law. Yes, you know, it's a major issue. Um, the federal and particularly our state government is committed to upholding the rights of uh, women. Uh, so we think that this is furtherance of that. Uh, it's an opportunity to also show that when we talk about promoting the rights of women, we, do, we are not just saying it that we are willing to uh, follow through with ensuring that our legal system responds to concerns about uh, the right of women. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.